Mm -hmm. Hi, I'm Toby Smithson with Diabetes Every Day, where you will learn tips and tricks for successfully managing your diabetes. Remember to hit the subscribe button. You are in for a treat today. Okay, I'm in for a treat today too. In this video, I will be showing you how to make my favorite dessert on loan here from my fellow dietitian and cookbook author, Marlene Cook. I have all of her cookbooks, which is a series of books titled, Eat What You Love. I make at least two of her recipes at my house every week. The recipe for today is called Chef Judy's Molten Lava Cakes, out of Marlene's newest book called Eat What You Love Restaurant Favorites. This dish is often featured on a steakhouse or seafood restaurant dessert menu. So let's get started in making this diabetes friendly dessert. The ingredients are two 1.45 ounce Hershey's Special Dark Chocolate Bars. I have the 4.25 ounce bar and will need to make adjustments. One tablespoon butter, two tablespoons low fat milk, one teaspoon vanilla extract, three large eggs, room temperature, separated, two tablespoons cocoa powder, preferably Dutch processed, two tablespoons all-purpose flour, one tablespoon granulated sugar, one tablespoon powder sugar, which is optional for dusting. Okay, let's get baking. Preheat the oven to 400 degrees. Set the oven rack to the lower third of the oven. Lightly coat four six ounce ramekins with cooking spray. Marlene's recipe says to reserve eight squares of the chocolate from the small bars, which is about one ounce. We have the 4.25 ounce bar and the equal amount would be four squares. We set these aside. Now, in a medium microwave safe bowl, microwave butter and remaining chocolate on high for 60 seconds or until chocolate is mostly melted. That's about two ounces of chocolate. So with our larger bar, we'll put in eight squares and have four squares left over that I'll need to deal with later. Okay, we stir this mixture until smooth. Whisk in milk, vanilla, and egg yolks until smooth. Next, sift in cocoa powder and flour and whisk to combine. Now, in a medium bowl with an electric mixer on high speed, beat the egg whites until foamy. Gradually add granulated sugar and beat to soft peaks. Fold one third of the egg whites into the chocolate mixture to lighten and then gently fold in remaining whites. Divide the batter among the ramekins. If using small chocolate bars, press two squares into the center of each cake. With our larger bar, we use one square per cake. Bake for eight to nine minutes or until tops are just firm to the touch and the cake still jiggles slightly in the center. Let cool for two minutes and serve immediately with a dusting of powdered sugar if desired. This recipe serves four and each serving is 210 calories, 21 grams carb, two grams fiber, 12 grams fat, seven grams of protein and 85 milligrams sodium. Now, this isn't an everyday food, but if you are a chocolate lover, you can adjust your calories and carb intake at your meal to fit in this delectable dessert. Here's to your health, enjoy.